And here we go on some uh, recording voiceovers of some Battlefield 2. Uh, I'm not, I was going to do like definitive map walkthroughs, but that's just not going to happen because every time I try and get in a match and show a strategy for a particular map, uh, it, I just it kind of either falls apart or it just doesn't go the way you expect. And so I'm not. I might do a definitive walkthrough if it happens and I happen to record it, but it didn't. That was while I was recording, so uh, <laughs> I'm doing it this way, which is I'm just going to tell you a little story about this match I had, which is pretty much me getting owned repeatedly. So enjoy as I just go through this little uh, match or two here and uh, show you just how I got killed lots of times. So I've chose this kit, which is a VSS, which uh, in close quarters, nothing beats it in my opinion. Yeah, it looks like uh, although it has got the recon sniper, you know, ghillie suit setup, it has nothing to do with sniping. I've got a laser scope on there, magnum ammo, C4, uh, what else? Uh, I think that's all you can choose. Um, yeah, it's pretty much built for close quarters combat. Just think of the uh, VSS as a high-powered, deadly SMG. It completely uh, eats ammo though, you get two motion sensors and only a few clips with the laser scope, so... So you're gonna make a uh, assault kit very happy with this uh, ammo being thrown out there. So I'm assaulting this base, motion sensors out to see if I can see anybody. And there is a few people in there, so I'll just rinse them off here. I completely missed the guy on my left there, but luckily he completely missed me. I made some sort of an effort to get him. And here, I'm um, like reloading, I see the guy get rezzed, I go for the knife, I, w I go for the knife on the guy who got rezzed, and then the, uh, it was the support guy, kind of dragged my the knife lunge in between them, and I tried to fight it, so I was knifing nothing but air. I'm just going to the options screen here, just to make sure that I definitely had uh, kill assist, aim assist off, to stop that kind of bullshit from happening. But unfortunately, it doesn't uh, work with knives, because they've got that stupid... Halo sword lunge mechanic with it, which auto aims even if you've got it off. So that sucks, so back to the uh, hunter killer kit, which I call the hunter killer kit because you uh, hit the motion sensors out, uh, stay in close quarters, and you hunt down people to kill them. That's primarily the function of this kit. I mean, there, there are more things you can do in this game other than just kill people, but if you want to kill people, then uh, in close quarters, nothing in my opinion beats the VSS, laser scope, magnum ammo. So I'm just guarding the, the uh, floor of this. They can obviously take this building down with explosives, but um, I'm going to make sure they don't arm it because that's kind of a humiliation. It was when they arm this crate and defe defeat the uh, this base by arming it. So I'm throwing out motion sensors and make sure they're not going to arm it. If they want to take this crate, they're going to have to do it the easy way. I'm not going to be uh, humiliated by them arming it. And uh, even though I put the laser scope on this thing, I probably don't need it since I don't even use it that much. I do, do use the uh, laser scope sometimes, but um, you should just don't even aim and just spray and it does it gets the job done. Because the uh, mechanics in this game are so easy to kill people. There, I wasn't confident on killing that guy, so I managed to back spot him just before I went down. And this is exactly where you back spot, so people can finish him off like that. And they decide to uh, blow up the building and take the crate down. I thought they would. They always do. In fact, you have to be a pretty poor team not to get that first base. Because both buildings are in the... Um, a, uh, both crates, I should say, are in a building that can be taken down. B here, behind me, is also in a building that can be taken down. However, A is not, so I'm going to focus my defense on A. Do the best I can. Uh, my team is not too great at the moment. The uh, point of this match really was that I was playing with Benzilla and we make a nice double team, but uh, he's left and I'm pretty much on my own right now. So I'm just this kind of a demo of even doing, fulfilling your roles, doing it right. There's nothing you can do if you don't have teamwork. And the other team on this were full of like massively overranked people that uh, just completely outranked outranked our team and outskilled our team and this is me just uh, putting up a last ditch defense and there is a reason why I don't think the VSS sniper rifle 
because it just has absolutely zero range. But that's okay, because uh, I expected to lose that. I'm going to say arm Bravo, and seeing as I am just one man trying to disarm Bravo from just sprinting over there, I'm probably not going to do it and I'm probably going to die anyway. So I'm going to focus still on defending A. Motion sensor, make sure no one's around there. But you have to remember that the motion sensor is a motion sensor now. If you're not moving, if you're not like in motion, it won't sensor you. So if people are standing still, uh, it won't see them out. So you got to be careful about that. It does work sometimes at long range VSS. Now here, I go to cover, but a uh, bullet lag, the wonderful battlefield cover system lets me down. So I go down there. And this is also the problem of when you're working alone like I am. As soon as I go down, I know that I'm pretty much the only one guarding that crate. So when I'm not there, that's almost a guarantee that it's going to be armed. And uh, there it goes, it gets armed. So I've got to do my best to try and get people off this thing. Past this miraculous floating window there. Make sure I'm not getting shot. Get the hell on this crate. Spray. In fact, the gust there, uh, the uh, little pistol here, is a much better. In fact, I really like this pistol. It's a much uh, better version of uh, for range than the actual VSS. So I was only the guys behind us because we were completely surrounded, and the guys just came up behind me while I was doing that. So <laughs> absolutely nothing I could do. Absolutely nothing. And they, so they're going to take that crate. See if we can get a quick kill just before they take it. Might as well try and disarm it. Motion minus assist is coming off. That's why we spam them out. Just get a kill, but uh, they've got us completely surrounded. They've got people on Overwatch, and that's how you play the game. And they completely took me down. So check out part two soon.